वेलकम टू पवित्र लैपटॉप केयर सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डू समथिंग न्यू एक्सपेरिमेंट दैट इज हियर आई हैव ए बोर्ड इट्स ए एल ए ए डबल नाइन फोर पी इट हैज वन पॉइंट एट वोल्ट बाय एस आई सी राइट दिस पर्टिकुलर मदर बोर्ड इफ यू हैव प्लीज चेक इट इट्स द बाय एस आई सी इज वन पॉइंट एट वोल्ट बाय एस आई सी now what i am going to do is the new experiment is i am going to write bias programming in rt809f okay rt809f so will it work anybody tried the 1.8 volts i see if we do the programming in rt809f for 3.3 volts so will it work how we can identify it's working or not same bias it has wrote or not it has written or not so that experiment i am going to do practically if anybody feel this is a, actually it's a not fact so please take same similar motherboard any 1.8 volts motherboard take bias ic and do what i show in this video okay so now what i'm going to do is from this motherboard i took out i took out this particular bias i see this one see what the name it's a 25q 64f w f w what the difference between 1.8 and uh, 1.3.3 uh, volts ic bias bias i see the major difference is the last number after 64 fv comes that is 3.3 volts bias fw comes that's 1.8 volts bias uh in many cases if we run the bias programming in 3.3 uh, volts programmer you will get no display but i already made a video if we do the 1.8 volts bias ic in 3.3 volts uh, programmer that's a uh, rt809f i showed the same programmer it was working i got display but i don't know others but you have to try yourself i got display okay now the same thing what the major difference in between 3.3 uh, volts programming level and 1.8 volts programming at present i don't have any additional card for this additional card required okay that's converter will be there 1.8 volts uh, from 3.3 to 1.8 volts that i don't have at present so that is the practical experiment i am going to do that will work it out or not how to identify it's uh, correct one or not so let us check now what i am going to do so i will download original file from the net the official uh, website from the official website and i will store in a new folder okay from that folder i will write to this particular ic and i will compare both that's correct right i will compare both the bias ic uh, once what uh, what are the uh, written bias i will again i will read it and i will save it somewhere so both i will compare and then we come to know the exact bias it will write it or not okay let us start practically we will do see now i am going to connect see here i have downloaded the file it's a sp8892 file it's from official website okay to uh, reduce the time length so directly downloaded file i am going to show you okay if you have any doubt please check with this sp8892 file it belongs to this particular motherboard or not okay so now what i am going to do is i am going to extract in a new folder on the desktop See, it's a SP notebook, 15 actually this model. Next, next, next. This one, what are the uh, what is that um, encrypted files will be there? No, that one now going to decrypt decrypted. See, decrypted file we will get now once it extracted. So now it will ask the path. the path by default i will give on the desktop actually i created a folder like a new folder there i am going to save it 
next the main file is extracted now see it's a finish actually this 0 double to fc multiple files are there see the size 1 2 3 4 files we got but for this model 0220f is the original file compatible file to this particular model this one is the original this one i'm going to write in the bias i see see now i connected this this programmer now uh, what i'm going to do is i'm opening the software I fix it's a very famous uh, uh, what is that programmer RT 809F. See by default what it will take. Please check. See whenever you uh, put that 1.8 volts IC by default it will take it's a 3.3 volts IC. See what IC I have I have W25Q64FW IC but here it detected as FV. See if I select the 1.8. See if I go to drop down menu. Here is the FW 1.8. If I select there, you will you will get a message here. See, please use 1.8 volts adapter. I am not trying this one. Okay, because some mismatch may comes. But the main concentration is I will write down in 3.3 volts uh, mode. Okay, what error we will get that I want to check. See, by default again, I'll go to by default one FE. FE means it's a 3.3 volts. Correct. So now I will write this particular bias. Uh, what is that file? See, I'm opening this. On the desktop we have right. Let's see. Desktop, new folder. Here, double two zero F okay i selected this file now what i'm going to do i'm going to write sorry it's a verify it took but anyway after this i'm going to write this see i'm going to write now see write it will take little time maybe 30 seconds it will show that time also how long it took By this experiment, we come to know can we write 1.8 volts bias in RT809F without selecting that 1.8. That is my intention. Okay. See, first it will erase. Auto erase started. Start writing. Auto verifying. Times elapse. It's a seventy one point four three seconds. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is it's already written. I will read this exact file. I'll save to that particular new folder. Then both I will compare it. Okay, can we do that? What already written here in this file, I mean in this uh, IC, that one I am again reading this. Reading in the sense what is there in this particular IC that it will read, right? So that one I am going to do. Now I am going to press the read. So this read in the sense already programmed one we are copying to the system. Auto verifying, read successful. Yes, it asking where I have to save. See, this is the name. I'll give three point uh, three V underscore. I'll give that's best option. Three point three V dot bin. 
it will take or not uh, again i will give the bin okay save now what i did i programmed in this particular ic and again i read this right so and i saved here see it's a 3.3 .3. now what i'm going to do is i'm opening the hex editor new fresh here is this compare file the option is there compare a file so now i'm going to select where shall i it's a desktop right desktop new folder 3.3 volts bin just now i saved right this is the one just now we read from the bias ic this one i'm taking second one compare with which file double two zero f right this one i'm comparing so now say okay wow so soon see guys here is the conclusion see this is the final step here is the summary one please read carefully when i gave comparison so here is the file 3.3 volts which i written here that file and here is which i downloaded from the site okay but ic is 1.8 volts how i written it's a 3.3 volts correct see completely it matched all green if any mismatch is there any modification will be there you will get yellow color one modified kind of thing correct who knows this ex editor so those people come to know what i'm going to tell exactly matching see here it's all are green if any changes are there it will show in the yellow now you have to decide can we write 1.8 volts bias program in 3.3 volts rt 809f because see i am simply i won't do all the things in the youtube many technicians was telling so we can't do it we can't do it or some other uh, reasons they are giving no display cases you will get uh, so practically we will check so can we get no display or not what is the truth so that i want that's why i am doing this experiment if you really want to know please do it yourself diy something we will call no so like that you come to know by experience so it's practically it's possible or not this one i did so that's why i'm telling i'm concluding here some maybe i'll use the word some of the ic's it's a 1.8 ic we can write in rt 809 f it's a 3.3 volts programmer we can write down in case of no display this is the not reason bias writing is not the reason okay that i mean to say directly you can write in 3.3 volts okay guys anything you have doubt or uh, regarding this any comments you want or any argument you want so please you are welcome comment box is waiting for you thank you thank you very much